The immigration controversy has ignited not only protests, but also efforts to help migrant families at the center of the crisis. Here's Carter Evans. Protesters flocked to the federal building in Los Angeles today to donate toys to children who were ripped from their parents at the border. It's pretty overwhelming response. On Friday night, they rallied outside the federal jail downtown where detainees have been housed. About 100 separated children are believed to be somewhere in the city. In San Diego, protests continued downtown, an effort to pressure the Trump administration to reverse its zero tolerance immigration policy. Shame! 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 Along the border yesterday, Senator Kamala Harris visited a detention center where immigrants are being held. These mothers have shared their stories, their personal stories that are a story of a human rights abuse being committed by the United States government. Back at the rally in L.A., Maria Vasquez no, no, says no, no, no. she knows what the children are going through. You left your family in Guatemala. You spent months in detention. You now have been granted asylum. Is it all worth it? Yes, it's all worth it. And I'm not one of the person that Trump thinks I am. This group is now planning to bring its protest to the border and deliver the toys they've collected to one of the detention centers. Meanwhile, California state regulators are beginning inspections of those facilities. Elaine? Carter Evans, thank you.